Now, when you start diving in cybersecurity, you come across the term called stagnography. What is stagnography? So when we come here on Kaspersky's website, they define stagnography as the practice of concealing information within another message or physical object to avoid detection. Uh, they go on further and say stagnography can be used to hide virtually any type of digital content, including text, images, videos, or audio content. So now into this video, I'm going to show you how you can hide data inside a picture. So now let's go on. Go on, open up your terminal. So now inside your terminal, you need to install a program which is called Stegahide. So go on and say sudo apt install Stegahide. Personally, I have this program installed within my system. So if you press enter after running this program, Stegahide will go on and install within your system. So the user I'm using isn't a root user that's why i'm using sudo but i already have this program installed within our system so after installing stagger hide you need to check it just come and say stagger hide you can even simply say minus minus help if you press enter you see that the list of the content all the flags that you can use to work with this program so when we come up here, you see that we have the term embed, which is to embed data. We have extract, we have info. But if we come here to embedding options, we have EF, which is an embed file, or we use to get the embed file. We have a CF, which is going to be our cover file. There is a, pass, a password phrase or a passphrase where you just provide a minus P. But if we come down here to extracting options, we have a minus SF to provide a Stegno file. This is a file which has a password or which has your data inside. So here we have a passphrase, we have a minus XF in case you want to extract the files inside that picture or your document. So let's clear this. Now, since you have your software installed within your system, and you're sure that it is active the next thing to do it is to get your pictures so now when we come to downloads you see i have some pictures here or we can go online and we download some stock images that we can use to embed our data so you see i'm on this website where you can download some free stock images and i can scroll down and choose any i want so i'm going to go for this one Let's download this, and it is this one. So we come back here to our terminal. After downloading our data, we need the information that we want to hide inside our picture. So if we list data here, I have a program which is called linipiece.sh. This is the content that I want to hide inside my picture. So now if we come here after installing your stagger hide, here we are going to say stagger hide like this and we need to embed data so you are going to say embed now here we are going to provide an embed file by providing a minus ef embed file this is the data we want to hide inside our picture so linip is in the same location where i'm working from so here i can just say linipiz.sh so here i need to also provide a cover file of a minus cf and a cover file this is going to be your picture so for a picture we need to go in downloads and in downloads we are going to go for that and you see it ends with a dot jpg so if i press enter they ask me for the passphrase so now here for a passphrase i'm going to type one two three four five six seven and i type in the same password so if we press enter now here they're telling us that this information is too short now i can go on and use another picture i do have within my program so i'm going to come back here i have another picture it is this one so i can use the second picture so in case they deny your picture go on download or use another picture so i'm going to just press the upper arrow key on our keyboard and i'm going to remove this 
so still we are on our path for downloads and my picture is starting with a Y and if I press enter I type in now here the password which is my passphrase I will type in the password so here we give it a few seconds our data of Lenny Pays is going to be hidden within our picture so now if you see here they are telling us that embedding lenypeas.sh into downloads and this is the picture's name and they say that it is done so now our data has been embedded inside the picture so what if i want to extract information within this picture so let me go to that location of downloads and here firstly let me first change the name of the picture we give it a simple name as image one dot jpg so after renaming our image so we need to extract information inside our picture so here still we are going to use tag hide and for this time we are going to say extract instead of embed so it is extract and here we need to provide a stagno file where we provide a minus f and here we provide the file which has our data so if i press enter you see that they tell us to enter our passphrase so when i enter the password i created and enter our data is going to be extracted now for terms of security if you are to share a password which is used to hide your data make sure you can share it to somebody via face to face than telling them that whenever i send you a picture the password is going to be this and you are sharing that sensitive information over internet or social media platform remember those ones can't be hacked and people can know that the password is transferred so make sure you can share the passwords via mouth to mouth so here our data line piece has been extracted and if we list here you may see that we have our line piece present so in my next video i will show you how you can hide data inside music thanks for watching give a thumbs up have a great day peace